Hey everyone, I'm Almar of AlmarsGuides.com and this guide here is going to go over how to set up a push to talk button in Skype. So Skype has been growing in popularity as the program gamers use to communicate while playing games, but there is one hard thing to figure out in Skype, how to set up a push to talk key. You know, that way they don't hear you talking to yourself all the time. So get started, click on your Skype icon, which is shown in this picture here, and bring up the Skype wing window. At the top of the Skype window there will be an option that says Tools. As you can see here, I clicked on Tools and the options drop down right here. From here you want to look at the left portion of the Skype window. Down at the very bottom it will say Advanced and show a little cogwheel. If this layout ever changes, still look for the Advanced option because it will be right here. As you can see, here's the general window and at the very bottom it says Advanced. From here you want to click on the Advanced tab and the little drop down menu will appear. From here, click on Hotkeys to bring up another window in the Skype box just to the right of where it says Advanced. At the bottom of this window you'll see something that says Toggle Mute and then parentheses it'll say Push to Talk. What you'll want to do is left click on the check box to check it on and uh, use it and then uh, left click uh, anywhere on Toggle Mute and click Change Selected Shortcut. From here another box will come up where you'll be able to change your shortcut that you want to change to you know figure out your Push to Talk more properly. After you do that, you'll be able to exit out of that after you, you know, save it and all of that fun stuff. It'll actually just auto save. Exit out and then go to go back to maybe the phone call with your buddy or uh, anytime you enter a phone call from here on out, what you'll have to do is uh, click on the toggle mute at the bottom of your Skype window. I have a picture of it here in the video and on my website. Click on toggle mute and then it'll say microphone muted. And once the microphone is muted, when you hit the push to talk key, instead of it toggling mute, it'll toggle unmute because it's still technically toggling mute. And that's how push to talk works in Skype. It's uh, a little bit weird and a little bit complicated, but after all, Skype isn't used and meant to be used as a uh, gaming voiceover IP program. That's for Ventrilo, Mumble, TeamSpeak, stuff like that. Uh, people that want to use Skype, this is the easiest way to get push to talk to work while in Skype. So aside from that, I hope this video helped some of you guys out. And uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, of course, as always, like, comment, and subscribe to me for future videos. See you guys around.